Hey guys, Sword here, and this is going to be Resident Evil 4 Let's Play Episode 10. And here's Ashley, being useless as ever, and I'm here with my best friend Kyle. And we're going to continue on where we left off from here. So, well, what else is new? I died, well, technically, Ashley died. I didn't shoot the hands in time, which I did not know about that till now. The things you learn as... It's like... You learn things at the very last minute where it's just too late. Yeah, it was, it was a pretty terrible fight. I was partially to blame for that. And I think you left Ashley. I think I did. I think you forgot to catch her off the ladder. And you're going to have to run back. Because <sighs> she can't climb down ladders. Apparently not. She can climb up ladders. But she can't climb down ladders. So she's exactly like a cow. She can go upstairs, but not downstairs. Is that how they work? Yeah, because they're knees. It's a really weird fact, I know. So, in that terms, Ashley is now a cow. There you go. But she can, well, she's going to walk down these stairs. So <laughs> I guess she's the cow only for ladders. Looks like it. <sighs> Ashley! Why are you so useless? Why what? So what? What? Hey, Ashley. Oh, I forgot to call her. That's why I have to have her. F <laughs> okay. She has to be in follow mode. Good to know. Okay, you're down now. Follow me, but I'm still gonna leave you behind because I'm pretty sure that there's gonna be another boss battle, and this one is really, really frustrating to do. You gotta do it right, and let me see if there's any treasures I need to be aware of. Nope, good to go. I don't have to worry about that. Yeah, this is a really annoying boss. Yeah, especially... There's like, I don't know, like 10 different ways to actually get killed by this boss. And there's a compilation video out there. I just don't remember where it's at. But it's really <laughs> interesting. Because apparently Leon dies like a walrus. I think in the game, this was my... When I first played through, I think this was my second death. Because... I was like, it's like, don't shoot the water. I immediately shot the water and got killed by the giant catfish. Tadpole thing. <laughs> the shadows is just a little bit unrealistic here. Look at that. It's just one circle. I want to go around. You better stay outside. Ashley, go hide. Yeah. Go hide, Ashley. Great awareness by Leon. Just, oh God, it's going to be an action scene. <sighs> Got to be ready. <laughs> Bumpers don't work. Oh god! It was behind you! The whole time! His beard looks like a beehive, and it went right through his skin. Yep. Which is weird. Ooh. Oh! You would be dead. If you were thrown by the big cheese. It's kind of funny, he appeared in Resident Evil 2, but he just doesn't make another appearance his until Resident Evil 4. Are also clipping through his back. Oh wow. Oh, look at this. Look at his coat. Everything about his coat is just not having a good time with this graphics engine. Yep. Yeah. Ah, uh, gasoline. If I can't beat you with strength, I'll set this whole building on fire. Boom. Oh. Boom. Graphics here. Oh, God. Slenderman? Oh, God. Oh. Oh, that's just, oh god. That's just, this is the real Slenderman here. The Big Cheese was the original Slenderman. That is something right out of my nightmares. Oh god. Giant centipede person. Like, I would... Whoa. Is there, oh no, okay. You got out without uh, having to do a dodge button. Gotta grab ammo. Gotta grab ammo. Excuse me, sir. Oh god. Oh, 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 oh god. There we go. That's what I was. Okay, so the cutscene makes me drop off down the floor and then he just picks me up randomly. Alright. I think uh, incendiaries do work pretty well against him. Yeah, because you burn them off first of all. <laughs> yep. <laughs> and then you just sort of lay into him with some TMP. Yeah, extra damage. Whew. Excuse me, sir. Whoa. Ooh. I was ready for that. Now, do you have to... Oh, man. I'll just use it. Do you have to shoot him in half? Or... 
Whoa. Do because I know. Oh man. Ow. Boom. There we go. Why wouldn't at that range? Why wouldn't you stab him in the face? Whew. Right. Oh, oh god. And he got a double. And he hugs you. I didn't. I didn't know about the double thing. Excuse me, sir. I yeah. I, didn't, I completely forgot he had a double. I did not know that. It's kind of weird to me. Oh, okay. I don't think I ever had to do with double. Just calmly reloading. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Hey, oh man. Whoa. Okay, so. Oh god, I'm dead. Yeah, I am dead. That's not. The, that's not the best thing. Okay, so, so, I did not know he could knock you off. I don't think you can go upstairs until you just cut him in half. Spoiler alert, you can cut the boss in half. <laughs> Everybody knows <laughs> at this point if we're playing a game that's like, I don't know, 10 years old almost? If if you're watching this video and it's your first time ever seeing Resident Evil 4, uh, I feel like really bad for you because... If you're of the younger generation, just don't play the game. Just do, outside. like, play Actually, new games. Don't, don't, don't play these old games. Well, the old games were the best anyways, because I really want to play all the old games. Can I skip this? Well, they're the best for us, because we grew up in a different... Uh, Can't skip it. ...mindset with all the games and crap coming Oh, out. I could skip it. Okay, I had to press select to skip it. Okay, dodge. Damn. Oh, X, Y. Whew. Okay, skip that. Okay, we're good to go. And here we are. Nothing happened. Okay. Now I gotta go cut the boss in half. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Going through. Grab an ammo. Well, I can't do that right oh, now. Oh, oh. That's not good. So. That would be big team grenade on the Wait, can I do damage with a regular grenade? Yep. If I do, then that'll be fantastic. OP. Whoa! Use the shotgun. Nah, I'll just be good. Oh god! Oh god! What? That it... crab man walk. Uh, when it comes, like you hit him with the flame right now. Whoa! Excuse me, sir. No, I'm gonna do another grenade at him. Then use the inflammatory grenade. Boom. <laughs> Some TMP at this hey, at this range it's better for the TMP. That reminds me of the Reaper. Alright, so yeah, it's regular Oh whoa frag grenades. Excuse me, sir. I Oh, whoa, okay, that that fire actually helped me. Frag grenades like knock him in a weird forward position. But uh Incendiary grenades knock him face down, which is probably a lot better. Excuse me, sir. Whoa. Okay, okay knock me into the fire, why don't you? There should be another explosive barrel. You know, you shoot. Like right next to him, like right now. Look. Where? Oh, no, never mind. Okay. Just circling around. <laughs> Just casual walk. Circles. They work. Excuse me, sir. Okay, I was ready for the dodge. Nice. Isn't me or the bosses actually get easier once you get older? Like you're nope. not you're, when you're younger, this terrified you. But when you're older, it's not so terrifying. It's just annoying now. Yeah, but now this is the hard part of Whoa. the fight. Yep. This is the really hard part of this fight. Oh, wrong one again. Ooh, sounds like he's getting ready to kill me. Climbing up the ladder. <laughs> you took a nice swipe at your back there. Yep. But I think now is the time for the shotgun. Of course it will be a redder when I don't not need it. Okay. Grab that. And a wow! Yellow. Now I need another green. <laughs> this is completely useless. You can't use it. Shotgun time. Is it? Yeah. Oh, oh, there's a green. Da, 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 there's a green herb. Dun 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 dun. dun, dun. Got to combine them all. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Oh, there he is. Swing around like some kind of crazy man. Whoa. He nearly pelvic thrust me. 
Oh, oh. I can't see him. He's got haymakers for days. <sighs> haymakers for days. I, I just can't see him. I honestly can't see him through the smoke. A lot of smoke. Let me see. I I guess you have to go down and <laughs> up every now and then. You can get up the ladder from there. I didn't know that. Right, he's going to swing down and he's going to blast his face in. Where is he at? Why didn't he swing down there? It's taking him so long. There oh, he is. There he is. Probably not that effective from this distance. I mean, you are hitting him. Is he stuck in an infinite loop? Is he? This <laughs> is Amazing. the thing. Just pull out your pistol. Amazing. Pistol into death. <laughs> I'm, this I'm, is I'm, a, I'm gonna save this clip. I'm gonna save this clip and probably send this to the game fails. In, infinite loop. Infinite loop. We found a glitch. Just like Resident Evil 1, the, the tyrant can get stuck on a 1x1 one one inch grating on the roof in the final fight. Oh wow, I gotta remember that then. Yeah. Look at that, he's just dancing. Take him <laughs> down. Alright. <laughs> oh, oh, wow, oh, wow. Oh, oh, oh. Why would you let someone do this? <laughs> You're just. <laughs> You've turned into a carnival game at this oh. point. Oh my goodness. Wait, let's see if he jumps back up. Oh, if he jumps back up. Come on, he's, he... he's in the distance. I see him swing over. Yep. Come on. Oh, 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 shotgun, oh, shotgun, oh. shotgun, shotgun, shotgun. <laughs> yep. Okay. You... <laughs> he's tired of being a carnival game. Where'd he go? Well, I'm going to try to do the same thing again. Yeah. Why not? Do the run around. Huh, let me see. If this is an easy way to beat this boss, I regret all the ammo and time I wasted fighting in the regular way. Oh! Oh, oh I just took one more shot! <laughs> oh, and he's dead. Ew. It's just, so you hit me, I hit you back harder. A bloodline severed. Severed. Defeat the, the village chief in the battle. In battle. <sighs> Look at all this. One. So I think as long as you don't knock him down from that point he was stuck on, you would have just been able to just shoot him forever. I probably would have been able to actually kill him if I would have used a stronger weapon to kill him with, like the rifle. Yeah. You got the false eye. And now you must escape the burning building. It, it was all like liquefying right there. Do I have to? No, I don't want to go through there. I want to get some ammo. It's not like the whole thing's going to burn down. Yeah. That truly is a false eye, because regular eyes aren't, like, really good and rounded like that. And it's, sometimes you can even have uh, an oval eye, and it makes wearing contacts impossible. Oh, it's, yeah, I heard about that. You're able to actually have oval eyes. Where were you hiding? <laughs> she was just waiting calmly outside this barn. Well, hearing you scream and shoot bullets and and dying, and then a, suddenly a fire broke out and like, and she doesn't do anything. God. She just sits there, unable to help in any way. It would have been actually really fun if she had an active role in that fight, and every now and again she would throw ammo that she found like through a crack in the wall, or if she throws a rock to distract them. Yeah, like she hits them with a, a big fat rock the size of her fist which is probably kind of small <laughs> and like you just get a free shot in if you're doing poorly or you get knocked down and he's gonna stab you again well he just did a combo on me he knocked me down and he instantly grabbed me so i had no choice to live well, and it probably wouldn't even be that hard to do because you wouldn't have to show in ashley in her entirety just like the sound like a little a little small cutscene in the sound like Leon and her weird voice and then just a rock beams him in the side of the head. <laughs> <laughs> that would be best. And I could sell the beer steen or beer stein. Twenty thousand potatoes, please. I'll buy it at a high price. Oh, yeah. Sell the spinal. Why not? I mean you can't put them in stuff, so it would be funny that you could. It's like you need a hundred spinals. It's like God dang it. <laughs> you lied to me. If you have fifty spinals you can put them all in this weird shaped item and suddenly receive the infinite ammo rocket launcher. Uh, I, rem <laughs> I remember. Don't you Don't you have to like... I forgot how you get that. 
uh, it, you unlock it after you beat the game, and you have to have a million pesetas. Oh yeah, that was fun. I've always, I've had that in my inventory just to defeat the bosses. My goal <laughs> on the GameCube was to get the max amount that you were able to get. If I am able to put that in the GameCube, and get my HD PVR back, I'll show you the progress I've done on my GameCube version of the game. Nice. Do I need to kill everybody back on top? Yeah, you do. Oh yeah, this is gonna be fun, people. At least you have, still have a lot of handgun bullets. So. Yep. Just stockpiling them. And look, I'm gonna climb onto the. Wait, but no, I. Ah. <laughs> you actually have to be on the other side. This is just lovely. Why would they build this this like this? Just There's only one way on, one way off. So if you miss your one chance to get off, you have to loop all the way around. Unless you jump. Oh nope, just. There we go. Oh, sweet. And the merchant's right there. Merchant. He's everywhere. Teleportation. Of course. That's just how it works with this game. Unless he's got crazy hidden tunnels all through the island. It's like, oh, it's like, oh wait, he went, he's off the server. I gotta run back. <laughs> he, he just stands right there, heavy breathing. Okay, I'm here. Just cut to a, a screen of him sprinting through tunnels lit with blue lights. And nobody messes with them either. Like the Gnados, they just see him running around, or it's like, it's like, oh, he's just going all the way to where he needs to sell his items. He just runs there, just sitting there waiting for you to come to the shop, and you don't even come up, so he just wasted all that time. He's like, like, oh my uh, god. Uh, uh, wait, I think he went that way. <laughs> Why am I bothering to keep up this illusion? <laughs> oh, wait, all the money. Yeah. It's always about the money. He loves the money. I would want to see like an animation up for the merchant, like how he became to be and what does he do with everything else. I'm pretty sure it's already up there on YouTube, but if it's not, somebody create it. Oh, the castle. Oh god. The the truck. Oh. Do I have to have her following me? Or can she stay behind? She she has to follow you. Because if it hits you, then it hits her. And, uh... oh, of course. Beep, beep. Beep beep, I'm a cheap. There it comes. Hey. Whoa. Boom. I was about to actually run into that corner too. Ashley has some serious grapes on her that she was just like, I'm not gonna move. I'm not even gonna cower. I'm just gonna stand and watch this truck crash. And as soon as you turn around, they're all behind you. Million man march happening right, right now. Up, oh, there's one person, a strangler. Always a strangler. Hey, strangler. Yeah, this guy. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. What? Oh, no, nope. uh, no. Nope. That's how he dodges. That's like the worst dodge ever. He didn't even. Well, I suppose rolling would be difficult. Yeah, especially when he has a torch in his hand. <laughs> and the torch that can magically light him on crazy fire from top to bottom. I like how the ammo was just instantly glowing. Wait, is there treasure around here? Did I just. Did I just no, okay, it's good. No. So there's a spot right there I could go, and then I have to get to that spot, then you gotta go all the way back up here. You're Damn. about to have to make a little more room because you got a green herb coming up. Yep. Well, I got all the treasures here, so I'm happy. Very nice. Treasure maps. Worth buying. Yep. One person wanted me to buy the rocket launcher, but I have... I'm going to save it. I know what I'm going to use it for. I just got to remember where exactly. Buy it. Well, I I, I know the, the spot. I may not know it directly, but... Uh... If it's coming up, then I'll go buy it. And Ooh, Velvet Blue. Velvet Blue. This is the new Spinal, people. If you didn't like the Spinals then, you're going to get Velvet Blues. Velvet Blue. That sounds like a crazy perfume. Yeah, it does. I'm pretty sure it exists. Whoa! He, once again, he could totally murder all of these guys. With the... Uh, that's the Million Man March right there. <laughs> Time to raise the bridge. You take that one. You take that one? I'll take this one. And... Uh, of course, stars barking in the background. Crank it, crank it, crank it, crank it, crank it. Crank it. Ha. Huh. Hold on. Let's see if they calm down. Okay, they're good. They're calm. Ha ha. It's funny how we could actually draw back the bridge from our side, but not their side. They're mad. Great castle defense system. Yep.
And this is the end of this chapter. 77, still above the average. <sighs> well, total, yeah, well, yeah. See, <laughs> and now I got a kill-death ratio of 140.5. <sighs> that's, 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 that's terrible. Yeah, that's pretty terrible. That's terrible. But it's been a while since I've played this game, and I don't have the best weapons to have. But still, if I were to kill 140.5 people in my life, I think I would be remembered. Maybe not well, but I would definitely <laughs> be remembered. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it depends on what you're talking about killing. If it's like, maybe at a war, then that would be something to be remembered for. Well, I'll just do it like Leon does, with a pistol, a uh, Machine gun, a hand, uh, a rifle, and a shotgun. I almost and said handgun. A pistol and a handgun. Well, there's gonna be a lot of treasures here, people. We're at the castle, so it's a merchant here. Yes. Uh, oh, of course, the blue flame gives it away. Everyone knows that castles are full of the best loot. Yeah, but there's no dragons in here. Full of velvet blues. Uh, velvet blues. Is a... Wait, where are you? Oh, hey, buddy. He just. Creepily hanging out behind you. Welcome. There's the treasure chest behind you. Welcome. I'm pretty sure you can see that through the window. Some rare things on sale. Some rare things. So now we get a large case. Yeah. Boom. Ooh. And then we get this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. There it is. The black tail is available. So is that, is it the black tail the the one that is actually worth buying? Yeah, that's the one worth buying and upgrading to the max. At, at max damage, I think. I think the the final upgrade for the black tail increases its damage extra, buying? and at max damage it does. Then why did 3. I three point five? Why did I spend? Why did I spend it on this? Well, it's like t capacity ten, firing speed forty or point forty. So I didn't really upgrade it that much. Yeah. So if I were to buy the black tail already, it's gonna be worth it. And then we oh, um, the broken butterfly is not worth buying because you get it for free. There's the riot gun. Though. Oh yeah, I remember. You get yeah. it for free. You get, it, you for get it for free you have later to get, in the castle. Yeah, you have to get Ashley for that too. And this is the riot gun that I was w waiting to save for. Yeah, riot gun. So I'll buy this. This is the best shotgun in the well, game. If wanna, I... Yeah, sell your shotgun to make sure you have room for that. Yeah. Gun. And then sell your handgun and buy the better handgun. And those are the weapons. Well, those are two of the weapons you'll be using for the rest of the game. Ah, yep. Yep. Yeah. In the Punisher. Thank you. a ton of money. Yeah, because I've only upgraded it twice, which... Well, yeah, it is twice twice power, I'll one firing speed, and one reload speed. Price. Yeah, I could sell this. I don't care. Thank you. And then I'm keeping the TMP, because TMP is actually pretty good. That's like the only one what you can you get buying? so far. Yeah. And then I can buy these at any time if I want to, anyways. In, in the game... If you didn't buy the TMP, like you can still beat the game without it, but is it is definitely job? worth it just to buy the TMP. It's not very expensive. Uh, you get is a lot of ammo old? for it, and it really helps fi just fighting enemies. I mean, it's great. Why wouldn't you want it? <laughs> All right, so let me see where we get. No, no, that's not what I wanted. Looks... Tail. Yeah, it looks better than the puncher at all times. <laughs> It's, it's just and it, it already has better firepower than the just, one that you owned. The only thing that's good about this gun is that you can blast through two enemies. But if you upgrade this, then it'll still still do the same thing. Is that old? Yeah. Or the, yeah, that's what it was. Yeah. Look at all that money I still have to spare, but I still need to save up for the better rifle. So I got the best shotgun and the best pistol for now. Yeah, and uh, you will later get the rifle, and you don't have to get a better. Oh, there's, there's, there's it, yeah, there's a semi-auto rifle. Wait, is this the rifle that I need to save for? Uh, I've, I like how you if you man, <laughs> I like how if you actually buy more, <laughs> buy more guns and more will unlock. Yeah, I think that you are supposed to get the semi-auto rifle right now, but I don't think you have to. Well, I'm thinking that you're supposed to get it. Isn't there a white rifle that you can get? Yeah. Is in, in later in this castle or? I think it's in the next area after the castle. <sighs> but I'm. Man, it's been a long time since I played. Yeah. I do remember having a semi auto rifle though. Because I'm pretty sure, like most people, I bought the Broken Butterfly and the 
the semi-auto rifle right here. So it's probably worth buying. Yeah. It's definitely worth buying because it's at 7.0. It, it does more damage. It is semi-auto, which means you actually have it reliably. It's going to help you later on, so I'm gonna, I'm definitely going to buy it. Yeah. So I'll sell the other one. What are you but selling? By any chance we find the other one, it's like, uh eh, Yeah. Oh. Yeah, you have to sell the... My controller just shut off by on its own. You have to sell the rifle and the scope for this rifle because you have to buy the different scope. Yeah, the, the rifle Thank itself you. was not even that good, anyways. Just yeah. sock so rifle. Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. All right, so what time you to buy the semi-auto rifle is that and all? the semi-auto rifle scope. I think this is actually a smaller gun too. Yeah, I think, yeah, it's one one block smaller. You'll have to move the ammo off of it so you can put the scope on the top. Just because it makes it look super awesome. Yeah. <laughs> you. It's just, got, you have to, oh wait, wrong one. Yeah, it's semi -auto. Is that all? Yep, wait. Yeah. You don't belong there. Yeah. There we go. Thank you. Ha. Huh. And now you can drop a couple points in the upgrades. What are you buying? The black tail. Whew. Almost to uh, two damage. <laughs> two damage. <laughs> That's per shot. Well, I know that I'm going to be using the shotgun more often. Yeah. Oof. Is that that's all for now, but that's going to be worth it. Thank you. Yeah. semi auto rifle. Is that all? That's going to be worth it. <laughs> Thank you. It's always damages. Is that all? Strength. At, at all points, damage is worth buying. Ooh, let me see. I'll just buy that. that, buy that. I guess this is the part where we spend all the money. <laughs> I wouldn't get capacity until Not we yet. Uh, empty it. 15 is actually good enough as it is. Yeah, so. it's, it's more than the Punisher, and it already does way more damage than the Punisher. So, this is still good right now. Yeah, the camp is pretty good for quite a while. And then we have all these. You can sell the velvet blues and all the crap you want to. Not yet, though. Now, yeah, you gotta get behind his shop, and there's a treasure chest. If you check the map, it'll show you. Yeah, I think it. Yeah. I don't remember the exact way to get back there. But... It's, it seems like you go oh, there. Oh, yeah, you go. Yeah. You can't go through one end, but you go through the other end. Just literally walk past. It. Wait. Oh, never mind. It was just because of the barrel. I am stupid. What is going on right now? <laughs> Alright, I think there's going to be a snake somewhere. I know that for sure. And then probably in this box. Double swipe. Yeah. Yep! Yeah! A second snake. And I get a chicken egg. Not the golden one. I wanted the golden one. Well, you'll get it soon. Oh, well. Gold. Money. Rings. This old village has all the gold Dude, in the world. Dude, look through the window like, you're stealing my gold bricks? Did well, you just steal my gold bricks? Whoa, stop <laughs> complaining. I'm selling, I'm giving it back to you. <laughs> Let's sell it back to you right now. <sighs> I thought you weren't going to upgrade the TMP. I'm not too sure, actually. I... You can, I mean, if you want to. Nah. It increases the power from 6 to 8, 4.6 to 0. 0.8. Let's go save. To the, it saves you damage every... Uh, Every six shots. It's not good if I don't know how to shoot the gun. I mean, not, not every six shots. Every three shots, it saves you... Uh, an extra bullet. Yeah, it saves you an extra bullet. And I have nothing in my hands, except a knife. Which, when it holds 50 bullets, is really cool. Honestly. Whoa. My controller shut off again. I think it's this battery pack. Oof. That's not good. Whoa. Yeah, you're going to have to change the battery pack out. No! No! Oh. Wow! <laughs> what will ever happen to the Let's Play? Well, I could easily get back. Tragedy has struck. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There we go. I just had a... Let me see. Oh, no wonder. Well, then. Well, let's make this time useful. Put that right there. Be upside down. Clearing space. 
200 bullets for the TMP. One hot. Bullets. Have the herbs lying just around, just in case if I find another one. <laughs> it's kind of funny. There's two spaces right underneath the rifle that you could perfectly put ammo in, but nope, it has to take those three. Yeah. I just love how this game works. Well, there's only one more size. Come on, controller. Case. Don't die on me. There's only one more size attaché case you gotta buy before you're all good to go. Ah, my controller keeps dying. I love how those three bullets take up, like, extra space. Oh, my God. Come on. Don't die on me. Don't die on me. Come on. If you, you can do this. If you reload your TMP, it'll actually save all those bullets. Oh, oh thank you. Forgot about that. Yeah. Ah, let me see. Take that out. Boom! Space opened up. And I think I said that the TMP carries 50 bullets. It carries 30. For now, 30. Why, why, I don't know why I said that. Because it was an upgrade of 50. <laughs> well, this is a good way to end this episode because my battery keeps dying. And we're already past the 30 minute mark. Come on, come on, press start. There we go. And we're about to up. assault the castle. Well, that will be for the next episode. So... My battery died. <laughs> Good to go, but at least we're stopping it right here. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you, Kyle, for joining me with these episodes, and hopefully you come back for the next episode. I most definitely will. Because I, this is a great game that we've played a long time ago, and it's just bringing back memories. Oh yeah. Just, just let's just hope I don't die in the next. I don't know how many episodes, <laughs> but I just have terrible guns right now. Now I have better guns, but back then, terrible guns. <laughs> Just didn't want to waste all that money upgrading for terrible guns. Well, have a nice day, everybody. I'm Sword King Zero. That is Kyle. As always, we will see you in the next video.